Now I'm going to show you how you can snooze notifications on an Android device. Um, I'm going to first go into the settings here on this Pixel device and show you how to turn it on. If you're using a non-Pixel Android device, um, the steps might be a little different, um, but if you kind of follow these basics, it should kind of be in the same place. Um, and once you turn it on, I'll go and show you how you can actually snooze an uh, incoming notification so it'll repop up uh, at a later time that's more convenient for you. So first we want to go turn it on so we want to jump in our settings and on most Android devices but here on the um, Pixel device you're going to want to head to apps and notifications. You can also just search for it in the settings. Most Android devices has a search option there in the settings and you just search for snooze notifications should hopefully pop up. Again, every Android phone's a little different. So on the Pixel phone, I'm gonna go ahead and head here. And from here, I'm gonna select notifications. And I'm gonna scroll down to advanced. And then tap on allow notification snoozing. If this is already on, great. If not, go ahead and turn it on. And now that it's on, we can actually swipe down to our notifications here and if you just do a if you just kind of pull it to the right you'll see a clock and a settings gear pop up and you don't want to swipe it all the way because that'll dismiss it so just to about right here and let go and now you want to tap on the clock and you can see it automatically snoozed it for an hour we can click undo or we can tap the one hour and change it to 15 minutes, 30 minutes, or two hours. So if I select 15 minutes, that text message notification is now going to pop back up as a normal notification in 15 minutes, or whatever time you've set it to snooze to. So that's how you can go ahead and snooze notifications on an Android device, especially here on a Pixel phone. Hopefully that helps. Thanks for watching that video. If you liked it, make sure you give it a thumbs up and go ahead and click that subscribe button so you can get notified about other helpful tech videos I post to the channel. Thanks for watching.